Okay, let's go put back deck on some two. Uh, may have to reload because I some twos not wanting. There we go. Okay, maybe. Please. All I'm trying to do is get you to work. Okay. It looks like it's stable again. I don't know what happened with that, but sure. And we've got an advent supply line. Where's the raid? Is this one of those that I have to do right away? No, it isn't. Operation Godwalk. Operation Godwalk. Let me save. It's just been such a long time since I've played. I apologize. Also, you're almost completely off. Yeah. I just have to catch this Pokemon. Okay. Okay. Commander, we have a mission available that's okay, reliant yeah. on time-sensitive information. That is time-sensitive. We can always finish our scans later, but failing to take on this mission could have serious repercussions Thanks, for the resistance movement. Heading course for Sector 1. Oh, and the, the reason why everything was all glitchy appears to be that it was using GPU power, and XCOM 2 is using... Commander, I'm getting faint traces of a signal coming through. Someone on the ground is trying to reach us. I can't make it out. Keep your eyes peeled for possible contacts down there. Commander, if we have to, we can send the spark units back into combat even when they're beat up. Uh, yeah, no, I don't want to send the spark unit back. As much as I want to use the spark unit, but, um... Alright, so it looks like we have two specialists, a grenadier and a ranger, a reaper and a templar. We don't need two specialists. Mm -hmm. Right. We have to go down pretty far in order to... Oh, right. We need to bring either the truth or big time. I think we need to bring the truth. Bring the truth. Um, who is your friend? Your bond is with High Tower. Okay. Is it from the... you said something about it being the uh, PlayStation, PlayStation version. version. Yes. Of the first XCOM game. Yep. Way back Thanks. when. Your friend is Stinger the Ranger. Spider suit for grappling and stew. I'm thinking spider suit for the sniper. Yeah. Yep, nope, that's the correct weapon for you. And yep, nice this looks fine. Uh, Gargan rounds? Tracer rounds. Get an even higher bonus. Damage. I guess. 
that helps everyone, right? I think oh, everybody can use Tracer Rounds, but that's not the one that gives everybody else a bonus to hit. Okay. So it's not really that useful. No. Well, oh, other than on a sniper that you want to have the highest chance of hitting. Um, Talon Rounds is increased crit damage. Dragon Rounds is fire damage. Venom Rounds is poison. Yeah, I can go with Tracer A better weapon. Yeah, how about the one that actually has upgrades? That sounds great. And your that's your only armor. And yeah, they should have kind of players. I don't have friends. I really wish like going between squad mates when you're in this area just goes between these six and not your entire mm. base. That's kind of annoying. Alright, which? What do you got for weaponry? Oh, I can't do anything with that. Oh, that's right. I can't do much of anything with your weaponry. That's I remember now. You're effectively a scion. It's not that bad of an idea. Yep, just gonna go with the right grenade. You, specialist, you only need a med kit. And. Skulljack. <laughs> CA okay. Skulljack. Skulljack is good. Yes, it is. Alright, so my weapons include either. This one, which miss shots do two damage and five percent chance that I don't take an action when I attack. Or first three reloads are free, and a five percent chance to instantly kill somebody. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that that sounds good. Uh, do you want to go with any other technique? Uh, not really. I like having specialists with two utility slots. So they can spell back. Okay, you're cool. Hi, Tower. You're a heavy. First off. First reload is free and clip size increased by two. I'm gonna go with the one with aim because you're a heavy. Launcher. different types of grenades. Sure, we'll go with that. And last and certainly not least is our ranger. Yeah, you don't get that. You get a bolt monster. And you get a hunter's axe. I remember that much. Let's see. I have one grenade and... What is a hat? That doesn't sound very hazmat. Immunity to fire, acid, and poison, and increases health by one. Yeah, that doesn't look very hazmatish. I agree. Yeah, it's like hazmat, but just for your torso. Yep. Although I think I'm equipping it. It's just badly made. Yes. And what type of. You are a ninja. Got it. It's unfortunate. I probably would have preferred the other one right now, but that's fine. Alright, let's go. It's been such a long time since I've done this. I can't die. Sky Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy.
Resistance operatives have managed to shut down an advent train that was passing through this area. As of yet, Just the aliens the... haven't managed to secure the location, so we're moving in to take advantage. Neutralize any hostile contacts in the AO. Secure the site and lock down whatever cargo you can find. Just the memory of the discovery of the shortcut to both times being hit caps lock. <laughs> <laughs> And then the way they patched it in the expansions just hit caps lock for you twice, really fast. <laughs> <laughs> because this makes sense. Anyway, we're in the new Arctic. It's just the old Arctic with a new name. Wink! He's a blind. Menace 1 5. Coordinates of the advent train are locked in. Move to secure. All right. Eliminate all hostiles. First and by far more important. There we go. Mm -hmm. Let's see, where can you go? We're gonna put you here for now. I'm on the move. Nobody yet? Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna double move because you're a ninja. Okay, there's nobody down that way, so. You have my trust. No, that's a different character. Oh, that was fast. My senses They're are They're apparently clean. that way. Uh, what was the button to rotate again? Um, there we go. Okay. They're apparently down that way. Okay. That's something I need to hack. That's something I need to shoot very fast. Got it. Oh, I have a disadvantage of some variety. Uh, fear of the Lost. Oh, well, that's not going to affect anything this particular mission. Hopefully. <laughs> I don't blame you on the fear of the Lost. Hey, more fire for CTS. Around this rock Got it covered. Hey, yes, all. but they can't see us right now, so it's fine. And you're going to go. When you love us, have plants. I don't know. I want one. I'm pretty sure that's not native to the New Arctic. Really, I would have never guessed. You know, water also probably not being native to the New Arctic, as in puddles. Yes, then. Буду на чеку. Okay. I think stay in Overwatch this turn. Let them come closer. Stay in Overwatch triggers. Of course, the heavy misses. The heavy always misses. Oh, hey, look. Tatiana's now a captain. Um, what? You weren't even close to it, but sure. Ah, crap. There's that I was not expecting. Maybe this was not the greatest of ideas. But we need no surprise. Yeah. Okay. You are the Axor. Yes, I'm aware. <laughs> I could be really dumb and just run out there. But are you implacable? No. <laughs> <laughs> then maybe don't run out. That's it. Really dumb. There's multiple targets surrounding that, so I want to explode it. Oh right, I can literally explode somebody's cover, but that's not what I want to do. I think I 
Still getting used to the controls again. I can actually. Uh, I can't get both of them though. Slightly out of range for it, I think. What, what does this look like? No. Yeah, they won't be in range together no matter what. So I'm gonna go like that. Take this! You are now on fire. Have a nice day. Yeah, I have the free pistol attack, too, don't I? We're doing that right now. I have a really high chance of hitting that one, but... That's because he has no cover. Yeah. 50% chance of crit. Yeah. I meant to cancel that. Oh well. I missed anyway. Yeah, I agree, that's annoying. As you order, Commander. But the problem is that I'm too used to Breath of the Wild's controls, and the controls are the exact opposite for this versus Breath of the Wild. Nobody's near there. I reach out from the dark. Boom. They should be lit on fire again. the ability to hack any oh that's right dramadons can't be hacked until you defeat their right you have to kill the squishy alien. heart first i remember you kill now. the alien controlling the suit then you can hack yep. the suit okay so in that case i am going to try the dumb thing because i'm probably going to have to reload this turn anyway herc hi uh let's see i think i'll go with the minor cache of intel yeah, I don't know if it's not a great chance either way. I mean, I would have been successful, but that's okay. Oh, skull jacking. Okay, that makes things easier. This person's still concealed. I just noticed that. Right, that will kill that one. Uh, I'm next to a rock. I actually do have cover. Yeah, but he's like mine. Yes. I didn't try it strike for my people. That looks so awesome. Couldn't really see it. Really yeah. Awesome. Well, the beginning part looked awesome. Yeah. How about that? That rock's on fire. Oh, I have momentum. That helps. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I can just run back and hide behind things now. Uh, I like this tree. Because that's full cover. It's squishy full cover, but it is full cover. All right, this is my last character. The Andromedon's my current major concern. Do you have anyone on Overwatch? No. Maybe you should have one person on Overwatch. I don't think it's gonna help because I have two people I need to kill really fast. Mm. All right, I think I am going to need to. Oh. Because if you don't have anyone on Overwatch, they're going to move around a lot. They're going to move around a lot anyway, because it's XCOM 1 that they don't move with Overwatch. XCOM 2, they're like, I'll just take the Overwatch, it's fine. Yeah. I haven't even played too hard. No, you haven't. But I have played 
the previous game yeah. extensively. I was doing so mm. well on my classic yes, Iron Man run until Operation Severed Fist happened, yes. and I haven't played since. Okay. There's a very good chance I'm gonna have to reload from this turn. And yes, I know they're gonna. Be a lower chance than I was hoping it would be. Yeah, this isn't gonna work out. I can't do enough damage. Unless if I crit. Nope. Okay, let's try that turn again. <laughs> that went poorly. I don't miss warm weather for controller sweat. I kind of wish I had one of those Xbox One Link controllers, because they actually have ventilation on the sides. Keep your hands cool. Yeah, but those controllers are as expensive as the Nintendo Switch. I don't mean the Switch's controller, I mean the Switch. Okay. Let's rethink Cunning Plan and not do something so ludicrously silly. I need to shred the crap out of this. Gonna be seen the moment I move. I think Outrider coming back up to here again made sense. I am trusting you. Any cover that's going to help me other than here. So I guess I'm going there. Let's try this again. This time it's more working. Thank you. Wish I would have done that in a different order. Minimal but damage! Gonna need to reload soon! Put you on Watch. Okay, I know that this one can run afterwards, so I'm less concerned about running out. Back. 
expect my best shot is firing. Because now I can have to. I'm not taking chance. It's been too long. My tactics are all rusty. I would like to borrow your shell, please. Can I tap you? No, I can't. This is bad. Fine, I'm just gonna stun it. Why are you showing me pictures of dead people? I killed them. Fair and square. I should probably have the camera actually here instead of there. I don't know how to position that tripod to do that though. Alright. Because I am not really going to save scum, I'm just going to choose a different action, which is stun it. Of course it would have worked perfectly fine to draw it this time, but fine. Just done it. Okay. There's one person on Overwatch, it's just pistol overwatch though. And it's already been triggered. So that's not. She's been targeted. You're shielding. Which sucks, and I really didn't want to deal with that. You're gonna fire. Oh, you're grenading. Since they're the last one moving, I'm not as concerned. Take on that Less damage, but lighting them on fire. Lighting people on fire is fun. Get ready for I a think surprise. it's a better idea because they're both humanoid. I would have gone with Well, it's easier to hit things that are on fire if I have a right. Let me double check that. Nope. Oh, wait. I nope. think it's just that they take damage until they're extinguished. Yeah, in that case, let's just go back and do regular. Do more damage? Deal some damage. Uh, how long does it take for shields to wear off? Um, That is... Was it... Three or four rounds? They are temporary, but I don't want them to live that long. And unfortunately, I didn't notice that Rec was saying things before because it's kind of overlapping, so I'm like, let me move the down. Hold on a moment. I, I just moved it someplace else. Where, where did it go? Mm. Dang it. Um, move to top. Order, move to top. But I don't know, it got moved off the side of the screen is the problem. Oh. Uh, do, 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 do. Here, I can reset transform. There we go. 
just move you like down there. Okay. Yeah, that's probably better. Yes. And then also doc chat. Now I can actually see what the Twitch chat is saying easier. Um, so Rek, what did you actually say to start with? Like, it just felt like playing over things was too much. I can't actually see what's above there right now because I may not think about my cunning plan. Okay. Cover's gone. That should help some. Time for you to learn the truth. Ah, uh, yeah, no. I'm going after the shield bearer. Thank you very much. Wait, before I do that, let's use lightning hands on something. Like, say, that officer. So that's a reaction. And I crit it. Nice. Been too long. There. So I could hit you easily. I could hit you really easily. I really need to take out that shield bearer. Don't I? No, I'm not playing... Yeah, so you're probably hearing it slightly odd because for some reason it's hiccuping. Uh, you lived? Rumble. Oh, go hide back there. Save her. Okay, you need to find cover one. this is going to have to do. It's kind of blew up most of the cover around, so. Yeah. And my only other option for cover is here. Once that thing wakes up, that's a really bad spot. But I guess it's not going to wake up this round. Hi, yeah, boy. Take you out, but not necessarily. I guess I could use combat protocol to guarantee that I'm taking it out, but. Claymore and then trigger the Claymore. Yeah, just make sure you It's, get... yep, yeah, it's far enough away. See? Yep. Yeah. It requires patience. And then... Ha! Why do I not have my own Claymore as an option now? I should have line of sight. Oh wait, no, that's right, it's firing on it is what it is, not... There we go. That's what it was. It's not remote detonation. It's been too long. Okay. Now I've got these two left. You're going to be slashing. You're going to fire on somebody. Dead. 
can't move into a flanking position before I chuck the axe. But I can get closer. basically have to crit. Yep, this is gonna go great. And the Andromedon shell is active again. Wait, it gets a turn this turn? It got a turn. You are surrounded by acid. Yes, but it didn't actually get. Not that I have any way of. Oh, I do actually have a way of getting out. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> this is dumb, but we're fine. Not that there's any cover anywhere right now. Skull mine without getting acid. That's why I was double Yes, nice view of your boots. Good job. Let's go for the small intel cache. Nope, don't even get that. I'm taking beat back damage. This is going great. And yes, if something can hand go bad, it's something to go bad. Great, more damage. That's what I wanted. All right, I think I'm just gonna shoot this and shoot the shell down. Yeah. Need a resupply. There we go. Прощай. <laughs> Everybody is so hurt. And you are going what back in the concealer. Outrider's going to be on Overwatch. I was like, no, because she's in concealment, she wouldn't trigger Overwatch. I will reposition. Thank you, Damage Roy. I won't let them pass. Well, I'm glad I have like two units that are uninjured. I'll maintain my watch. Okay. Time to heal some. I have one use of a med kit. I have three injured characters. No, I have two injured characters. I'm gonna heal Stinger then, because Stinger's way more injured. It's not great, because I blew up all the cover, but there's nothing over here, at least. That didn't actually heal. You healed yourself. That's not what I wanted you to do. Yeah, I was wondering why you uh, nope. targeted self. Also, I think I need to compress my saves because it's slowing down a little. I know why this is running slow. I have this on the slow SSD. And I bet XCOM 2 actually cares about disk access. Well, I can fix that later. Okay. Um, no one will slip past. Vamos a movernos. You know what, you're just gonna double move and I'll heal next turn. Back in! Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've caught a couple of those. They're cute. On overwatch. And 
And I suppose I can move the truth up a little bit. I mean, you can't really handle her, but that happens. Yeah, rec for reference, this is the large, slow SSD that I'm talking about. So it's a two, ter two terabyte SSD. I'll just move it over to like a one terabyte SSD or something. I am on watch. I hear something. Ah, crap. Well, it's go time already. I only struck their armor. I didn't get a chance to heal. This is gonna go great. As usual, the heavy can't hit broadside of barn. Oh, come on, focus! Pops has got me flanked! Yes, yes, I'm aware that you're flanked. I'm not gonna let you be flanked for long, don't worry. Viper, please. You didn't kill the Viper, you grazed the Viper. You dealt a decent amount of damage, though, so I'm not going to be too complete. I can take out the Viper, start injuring the Andromedon, and I think taking out a target's a better idea right now. And I missed. Of course. You're still in cover somehow. Can I explode anything here by no. Just things that are nearby me. As usual. I am at your service. I may end up getting revealed by doing this, but it's not good. The only thing possible for aliens. Nope. Not revealed. Sweet. I require a resupply. Yeah, I'm aware. That will heal both of us, and that's good. So I'm going to do that. Yeah. Heal both of us. What? It's range, not the area of effect. I didn't get a choice as to where I targeted. Mm. What? I keep hitting cancel instead of accept because I've been playing Nintendo games. Grrr. Try this again. I still have a corner of the green screen available. I'm seeing it. Well. Okay. There. I do actually have a choice. You the one that's horribly injured, please. Thank you. Todo cubierto. Confirmed. Crit it this time. That's convenient. Got him. That makes things easier. Okay. I have a really low chance of hitting that one. Yeah, I can also blow up the cover this way. The trap is set. 
And it's not the um, it's not loot. It also shredded armor, which is do we useful. Have ammunition available? Yes, we do. Don't worry. And it's nice. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna stay where I am. are just these two. That's right, which can go in, hit, and then run back. So that actually does make sense for me to know, because I can kill it with the other one either way. And if you run up, you might trigger more aliens. Yes. Let's be cautious for once. Not normally cautious, but you know. Alright. Let's see what Could go run up and stab it, grabbing something and then run back. But then I can potentially trigger something. Let me say it first. I don't want to deal triggering even more things. A righteous strike. Yes, please. That looks really useful. And then... Well, I can't run back all the way, but then again, this is melee, melee enemy now, so I'm not as concerned. I do have somebody on Overwatch. I think. Or did I not do that? I do, okay, good. Not that it did enough damage, but good job on hitting. I'm getting punched in the face, aren't I? Oh yeah, that's right, I forgot. I can counter attack. <laughs> See, this is, these are all the things that I don't remember about the game. Um, this is going to be a reload turn. Is it? As in reloading ammo. Oh. No, things went really well. I'm not going to reload the game. I'm saving the game. Thank you very much. <laughs> but... My watch begins. Reload. Preparada. You have free reload, don't you? Ven y verás. Ready to go. Got it covered. Watch. Set that. Reload. This one. I'm boy. Yes, I'm I'm reloading. You also had free reloads. I should really be paying more attention to who has free reloads. You're gonna go over to here. I'm trusting you. Is that a civilian? Yes. This is the shot we've been waiting for. Take ah, that crap. Thing down before it has a chance to run. Well, it doesn't see me. I can probably free the civilian. Thank you. As you order, civilian. Commander. Yep. Thank you for the supplies. I, I need have that. no place for you. Do more scouting and free more civilians. Oh yeah, who do I see? Two mutons. Great. Mutons, just what I don't want to see. I'm on the move. Thank you for more supplies. Your material is secure. And ugly. Um what am I capable? Oh, just the thing behind me. And, oh, that's at least useful to blow up. I'm not blowing it up right now. I'm just going to get people closer first. Because she's kind of out of the way right now. I see everything. Of course, I have no cover in between because I blew it all up. But... Uh, that's what the moving is for. That's what moving to the opposite side of the caravan's for. I can make it! Huh. 
dilapidated diner, it looks like. A restaurant of some variety, at least. Hmm. Allá voy. Moving to designated position. Furman, covering now. Honestly, that's a really good spot for me to keep the truth. Since I have squad sight. Yep, you're staying there. Maybe I should have blown it up this turn. They didn't see me. Because you're so far away. <laughs> okay. They didn't know this being shot at. Okay. Okay. Does that mean I can blow two of them up now? No, I can blow none of them up now. I think I'm going to reload and actually blow it up. Because that was a poor decision. And yes, that wasn't a counter. That was Hamido. You're absolutely right, Rack. You think you're attacking me? Oh, you fool. Slicey dicey. I should plug my phone in. Uh, my phone's underneath one of your phones. Okay. Just because it's at 36%. Yeah. Okay. And actually, wait. Before I do that, watch. I'm just going to move everybody else into position first. This makes sense. I'm starting to remember what strategy's like. It's been such a long time. Tactics. Eh, yeah. Strategy's a little more. Long term. Yes. Uh, yes, you will hide behind this tent because this makes My perfect sense. Are keen. You will hide behind Adelante. this oil barrel because that makes sense. Ay, boy. Tent could be made of Kevlar. <laughs> it... Rolling! <laughs> it still wouldn't. Covering now. No, no. Oh, no. no, not really. Okay, time for boom. Watch closely. I can't watch closely. There we go. Dealt 12 damage. Looks like one of them came back for more. Let's make sure to take it out this time. Yes, aim after the big one. I approve. Seven damage, pretty good. Eight damage, even better, because I just killed it. Than an eye. No, I didn't. It just has lot gobs and gobs of hit points. On the plus side, there's not really much cover for them to hide behind. On the minus side, I'm kind of out of other watches at this point. You're gonna throw it. Oh, okay. Plasma weapon. I remember those. I'm mostly out of overwatches though. Are you turning your gun on? But you missed. Okay. This is... This isn't even just salvageable. This is doing well. Nobody got hurt this turn. That's the bar that I have. And I think my problem with trying to play through any FFT rebalance mods is that I'm just too used to how broken FFT is. Alright. We're gonna do seven to nine. Every time I hit this thing, it's gonna get another action. I remember that. Mm, thank you. Fighting psychics, so I need it too. Um, I could reach up and slash it. So that's a really smart idea. Uh, 
flanking position on that new time. Of hitting. So, no. I'm going to be in any position to attack anything. That's affirmative. All right. I think my best option is to start with a snipe. Hope that I read. I don't think I'm going to, but it's possible. I did. I didn't see how much damage I dealt, but I crit. That will cause it to move close. That should have caused it to move closer. Поехали. Is it already this turn from being shot? No. Are dead now? It's stunned for three turns. It has two hit points. Okay. That worked. Reasonably high chance of critting you. I'm gonna do that, even though that's probably gonna reveal me. It did not! I am not revealed. Nice. I approve. Okay, I've got slashing, which does not work against mutons. I remember that. I have an incendiary grenade. But I can finish off the Zerker Queen, but then I'm a sitting duck. I'm not going to use plasma grenade because I need to get closer and I have a kill zone. Um, protocol is useless right now. Combat protocol can take on that new time. That's probably the only best bet. Uh, yes. Um, Mutons do, in fact, have Hamido as well. Alright, that one's dead. are going to shredder gun that guy. Make sure I'm not hitting any of my own people. I am not. Get some. And I killed him anyway. Sweet. Which means I am now rending the Berserker Queen. I'm going to save first, just in case if there's even more baddies behind me. There probably isn't, but... It's probably the last one, actually. But not necessarily. A righteous strike! I saw part of that. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area oh, is secure. Yep, that was the last one. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Mission accomplished. The so ignore the turret fallen. sitting there. What exactly she planned on doing with this thing? I would be curious to hear her reasoning. Although I would question whether reason was ever involved. Oh, in Dr. Pollen. I remember my thing is that I prefer having the mission name on every one of these that I take. So I usually hit randomize until I get one with the mission name on. the camera was better on that. One of them, I don't even see their torso. Yeah. One of them appears to be in a large amount of pain. <laughs> and then there's the truth. Yes, and then there's the truth. But I like that one. Let's go with it. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, it is actually glitching during the loop. That's fine, though. Alright. We completed the mission. It took us an hour. Going until the start of the next mission. I'm glad to see that our cooperation with the resistance really factions least. is going yep. so well, Commander. Their soldiers seem to be a big help around here. Passing out. But first, let's promote the truth. All right. So, oh, the truth is actually a mostly pistol based. But I don't have return fire. I like kill zone, so I'm gonna pick that. I do have long watch. So yeah. Go for High Tower also leveled up. Uh, I really like hollow targeting. I mean I do like having extra use of grenades, but hollow targeting so good. <laughs> I have one of Dr. Proof. Valen's test subjects. I can begin an autopsy on the specimen as soon as you give the order, Commander. Well, maybe when you're done. Soldier bond available. Nope, not what I wanted to do. Do for you, Commander. At one point, I thought about trying to bring in an advent mech to see if we could integrate the Gremlin AI. The idea being to bolster our staff with robotic assistance. I eventually decided not to bring it up to Central or Tigan, at least not until things settle down some. Okay, so it's a few soldiers. I don't mince words when it comes to aliens, and the skirmishers are no different. I don't trust them. And I don't like sending my people out hand in hand with them. That said, they're definitely loyal to the commander. And they could put up a hell of a fight. I would have thought I would have seen it from here. I can't click on them because I'm using controller mode. Do I... How do bond? How do bond? chance of a free move after your first move. Off the turn. Yes. Parkour! You just really just yell parkour and that's it. I love parkour. But that doesn't that, seem bad. Yeah. Useful this on the other hand actually seems extremely useful. Ooh, yeah. Or it, explosives can now crit. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> but these cost supplies. The thing that I'm low on. But I think I'm still going to do these. Oh, maybe that's what I was planning on. I was going to buy all of these up, and then I don't need the guerrilla training school anymore. Right. That makes more sense. So I'm going to do that. So, which means, yes, bigger booms. Or biggest booms. And nice. mentally awake. I can afford one more if I really want to. Let's... Extra aim and the ability to crit when taking overwatch shots. That seems really nice. Infiltrations, hacking increase, and security towers can't see Reapers. Useful, but not as useful as the other yeah. one, in my mind. I don't normally use Reapers to hacking. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, I 
was offered a new thing. Resistance contacts are not bad, but I really need the supplies right now. Avenger plotting new course. I also really would like to have people stop being injured. That would be nice. I used to be a lot better at this. Oh yeah, I should actually capture that Pokemon that you pointed out. Not just tapping on it. These findings will likely prove huh. crucial to our ongoing efforts. We have command. finished our Andromeda autopsy. The fact that this armored environmental suit is capable of functioning in combat well after the original wearer has expired is remarkable. I must consult with Shin for further study into this unusual behavior. Although I was extremely hesitant to perform an autopsy on this creature before an extensive analysis of the fumes vented right with regularity from its suit. My concerns were overruled by the rest of the senior staff due to our overbearing time constraints. It was with some relief I discovered the most common element to be argon, an otherwise harmless gas when handled properly. Although similar in size and structure to the muton species, the Andromedon, as it's been known, as come to be known, does not appear to be of the same genetic design as the muton. I stress design here because, perhaps more so than all but the most extreme examples, the Andromedon was engineered to exist only within the confines of the environmental suit that we see them wearing in the field. Destruction of this protective equipment results in a reaction similar to what we might see if a human astronaut were to remove their helmet in space. That is to say, a painful and unpleasant death within minutes. Our Titan. Good name is Levine, as in one of the creators of Exhale. And now we can make proximity mice. Yes. Are we going to? I mean, that sounds awesome to me. And we have a breakthrough for improved vector rifles. I mean, I do love setting traps. And we have a breakthrough for improved bullpups. I don't even remember what the bullpup is. Bullpup is... Oh, that's the one that Worf uses to pull the yes. enemy to him. Or, no, that's his normal weapon. For a skirmisher. Like, okay. what he fires. Uh, I think I have to do the breakthrough, though. Because this is a one-time thing. Yeah. And, hey, look, plus one damage permanently is a great plan in my mind. Yes. Even if it's only I on a single unit as soon right as we have something of note. While most of my involvement in the chip development process was on the theoretical side, I can't help but feel some degree of responsibility for the final product as we see it in use today. When intently focused on a singular aspect of a project, in my case, countering the body's rejection of the implanted chip, sometimes it's easy to avoid seeing the bigger picture. To this day, I still ask myself whether it was willful ignorance or unbridled curiosity that led me to blindly pursue my research with such zeal. Alright, this soldier also got promoted. I thought I had chosen this already. I'm choosing hollow targeting. And can't promote that one until they're back. Anyway, continuing on. Our soldiers took some hits during the most ah. recent covert action, but word from the medical team is they'll all be fine. That's why they just came back with stuff, like two Illyrium cores. <sighs> Olga got injured, but that's fine. Not like I don't have crap tons of medbay space. Yes, new covert action. Uh, we can increase income in a region. The risk is a soldier getting in wounded, okay, and one soldier will get their aim increased permanently. Recruiting an engineer, or, oh yeah, reward is getting an engineer, and if I spend 25 alien alloys, it's no longer a risk, and one of those soldier rewards is plus one mobility, which is one of my favorite ones. Ah. Uh, hunting the chosen warlock, which I don't want to do right now because I just deal with all of this. Um, the black market giving us an extra 30% on things that we sell to them. Making more PCSs, which are those upgrade abilities. Improving combat intelligence, which, okay. Forming a new bond, I don't need to do. I have bonds for pretty much everybody at this point. 17 ability points, and 
Lightly wounded soldiers can be sent into combat. I don't really care about that. I think I'm going to go recruit an engineer and get those... and get some mobility. Yes. That's probably what I do. All right. Who do I want with more mobility? I do like having reapers with more mobility. But I... can we spare to have her unavailable for how long? Yeah, it's seven days. Hmm. It's not a huge amount of time, but it is long. Uh, the other ones that I like doing would be rangers. Because basically, do I want a reaper or a ranger unavailable? Um, I think I'm gonna go with the ranger. Yeah, because we don't have a lot of high-ranking officers not wounded right now. Right. All right. I need to bring a soldier. Does not matter what. So I'm going to Gary. Gary's going. And the soldier can be wounded unless if I spend 25 alien alloys, I will spend the alien alloys for that. That seems worth it to me. Yeah, we have. We have alloys. That's not something we're lacking at the moment. We don't have a huge amount, but we're not lacking in it at least. All right. Go to Mexico. I'll order my people to get underway immediately. Covert that action. I can definitely use another engineer. Going back to the bridge. Oh wait, no. I need to level up somebody. That's why it's telling me, hey look, you should actually go look at this cool little chunk. A sharpshooter that I sent out. You now have long watch, because why in the world would I ever take return fire? I mean, don't get me wrong, I like Return Fire as a concept, but you know what I like better as a concept? Long Watch. Long Watch. <laughs> Alright. Yes, I am getting plus one mobility on a soldier. I also get an engineer, but who cares about the engineer? I'm getting plus one mobility on a soldier. That's way more important. Still seeing that though. Well, I can adjust it if you want. I mean, the real problem is that what I... Why does our window have to be a rectangle? It doesn't have to. Like, can we just cut off the... That's what I was trying to do before I started streaming. It's possible I don't know how off the top of my head. I've seen somebody else do it, though. It's something for later. All right, so... Enemies have a dark event complete, so now they're, it's going to be harder to sneak up on them. I'm, that's annoying, but that one's not that big of a deal in my mind. I think I counteracted a different dark event instead. I have my first Scion! Soul Fire. Depending on who you ask, psionics could be considered the alien's greatest strength. Now our own psi operatives can tap into that same power. Huh. So they constantly train. But if they're injured, they have to recover from injury first. That makes sense. And I get to choose what they take. Oh, I've seen enemies use that. That's nice, but I would rather go for yeah. this. Definitely gonna need to upgrade this as well, which costs supplies and that I don't have. Well, I need that engineer to get enough power.
Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to level them up. Okay. I guess I know who I'm gonna be taking on the next mission. So this is where I can add the miscellaneous abilities on this. At Outrider. You've done a hell of a job keeping this ship together, Doctor. It's all we've got. And I know the aliens aren't happy about losing one of their own. I doubt they thought anyone could get this heap airborne again. I'm more than happy to prove them wrong. I'm sorry, I can get squad sight? Oh, I already did. Wait, she had squad sight? <laughs> I didn't even notice. Ooh. That sounds interesting, but usually I use explosions to soften things, not for initial. Sounds useful. I have a lot of soldiers that I can upgrade things on now. That's the only downside to all the expansions for XCOM 2 is there's so many different options that I always forget about them. If that makes any sense. What do I have for the truth? Let's look at the truth. Retired, but that doesn't mean I can't learn things. Last padding's useless on a sniper. Not very useful, you mean. Rupture sounds great on a sniper, thank you very much. Yeah. And then implacable on a sniper. That actually sounds really useful. I think I'm gonna spend some ability points on this. Because I snipe something which would normally take my move as well, kill them, then I can move the sniper up. It's not like they're going to be on Overwatch, so that sounds really useful. Yes, please. And while you're at it, how about Rupture? Yes, I know I'm going to be using my shared pool. That's fine. about my higher level sniper? Chain shot. <laughs> also Rupture. Running gun is not exactly useful on a sniper. Untouchable. Could be useful. I mean, yes. In the zone? Yep. That's basically in the zone. So many abilities. Yeah, getting return fire attached to long watch would be awesome. And yeah, running gun wouldn't be bad for a pistol sniper, but eh, I like I if I want a pistol sniper, I would rather use a Templar. Just because Templars also have pistols and can't do anything else. Rapid fire on a heavy sounds like a terrible idea. 
Yeah. Guardian on a heavy doesn't sound that bad when I do. Guardian on anybody sounds nice. Implacable on a heavy, on the other hand, sounds awesome. But, oh, I bet I was trying to wait until the heavy reached Colonel so I know what that last ability is. That would make sense. Anyway, enough of that. I have advanced explosives. I have an EMP bomb. Okay. That could be really useful because I can use that on my own soldiers and not hurt them. Right. And an acid bomb. I already had one, but sure, I can use another. And a gas bomb. I already had one. Uh, okay. That was a lot of things. Do I actually have a serpent suit? I don't think I do. Hmm. I only have six Lyrian cores, though. I don't have blue screen protocol, though. So I should have at least one of those. Sounds good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. There we go. message for you commander no. patching it through to your quarters now you have made considerable progress against the right. aliens over support. the past month commander i hope that your ongoing efforts will only lead to further success thank you shadowy trailer person the elders have blessed me oh no empowered me that's obnoxious That's an obnoxious ability to level up. Ah. Oh. You're still training. Oh, that's fine. You've been defeated as well. So cool. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll spend the intel to find out what the event is. Okay. So, loyalty among thieves does nothing, because the only one there is the warlock. So I don't care about that. The collectors is annoying, but it's less of a problem than rapid response. So if I'm going to stop one of those, I'm going to stop rapid response. Okay. Alright, and my orders. So, the Templar abilities I have no reason to change. I don't want the one when squad mates die, because I'm not going to let anybody die. Mental Fortitude's not a terrible thing, but eh. Whereas the other ones give me ability points, and I'm now using a lot of those. So, those are going to stay. Skirmishers. Um, construction speed increase. Not necessarily the most useful thing right now, because I'm not constructing anything. Because there's no space. Yep. And experimental grenade and heavy weapon projects are completed instantly. That's at least more useful, so I am going to swap that with inside job. Reapers. Supplies from each supply dropper increased by 15%. Yes, please. Everybody gains plus three mobility for the first two turns of battle when squad remains concealed. Yes. Okay. Suit up. Armor and vest projects are completed instantly. Supplies from supply dropper increased by another 10%. Nice. And weak points. Any shredding attack does plus one shred. Yes, please. So the only one that I don't know is, do I swap suit up with resistance network? Where contact is made instantly. I don't even know what that means. 
um, when I'm expanding the range that I have of my resistance network. Rather than having to sit there and wait a certain number of days to make contact, it just happens immediately. Yeah, but you're not expanding much anymore, are you? I'm going to. I don't know if I'm going to expand this month, though. I also don't know if I'm going to build any more armor or vest projects. think I would rather do that just because I don't care as much if my engineering facilities are taking longer. I care more if my soldiers can't move out. Okay. Uh, that's pause. How do I continue? You are the boss. Like that, apparently. Ooh, that's a very large supply drop. I will do that once I'm done with my current supply drop. If I ever finish the supply drop. Strategic Yay. resource located. It was only 65 compared to 500 and something. I think I'm gonna go for 500 and something. Available new yep. course. So I should check up on my therapists to see who else needs to have some therapy. So I, I remember right, Praetal Mox's negative trait was really nasty. It was something like it was constantly causing me to, um... I think it was a Berserk type effect. Alright. Firmary. Um, I only have one soldier that has a negative effect, and that's the one that's the, um... Fear of the Lost. Might as well. The only one I have. Uh, there's... Yeah, okay, there are people in Sigbang. It's like, there's nobody in Sigbang? What? The results of our breakthrough were quite fascinating. Right. We are inspired to take an autopsy of the Berserker Queen. So, okay, that takes one day. That's fine with me. The most dangerous of my three test subjects, the Berserker Queen, also represents the greatest leap towards the boundaries of what could be considered reasonable and ethical research. Even in wartime, I must consider the fact that by providing an already unstable alien being with equipment that may further its own capabilities, I risk crossing a line. That can never be uncrossed. Damn it, Valen. Did we ever find the one exact? Um, because science with an exclamation point at the end, I think it's always the mysteries of the chosen's only? creation yep. by the elders will likely be left only to fear. Oh, I was hoping you would keep talking. Oh. Hey, look! My psi operative has gained insanity. The ability to yes. insanity. Now my options are stasis, sustain, and domination. Um, yeah, I I'm just going to do that one. I'm just going to do that one. I really like sustain, but... But um, permanently gain a pet. I'll take the pet, thanks. Oh, right, I can upgrade things now. Oh, wait, no, I can't, because I need power. I can handle power. I just need to move some of my engineers out. I don't have anywhere near as many injured people now, so... There we go. Is this thing to be upgraded? Maybe that's... Aha! That, okay. Yeah. I think it, um, that's not a bad idea. I need a lot more power, don't I? Anyway, I am going to upgrade this. No, I'm not, because I don't have the supplies. I am going to pretend to upgrade anything whatsoever. I 
probably just about done with us. So if you do want to head out for a nap, you can. It's not like all the here. When inspired, our team is actually quite that efficient. Took like an hour and a half. As Dr. Valen noted in her own report, it was irresponsible and borderline irrational for her to have pursued this research, knowing the incredible risks involved, not just to herself, but to what little of humanity as a whole remains. Despite a thorough examination of the modified Berserker variant known as Subject Beta, I have yet to uncover any meaningful justification for the enhanced equipment provided by Dr. Valen to the creature as it relates to her own research. Let me be clear. I fully understand the creature's enhanced endocrine system requires the addition of this supplementary transport and filtering mechanism to maintain hormonal equilibrium. As well, I admit that it is a reasonably elegant solution to an otherwise daunting question. What I cannot understand is, why the hell did he- why the hell did she do it? Um, why was it necessary for Dr. Volland to take this relative certainty beyond the theoretical stage? There was no need for a proof of concept here. The end result was no doubt clear to her as it is to me now. I firmly believe that she made a conscious decision to see her work through to the end, knowing fully well the risks not only to herself, but to everyone else who might encounter subject beta in the future. I'm thankful we found the creature when we did, and that our forces were capable of neutralizing such a formidable enemy. The senior staff has agreed that the remains of beta would be best utilized as part of an enhanced armor suit, although the conversion actual conversion process sounds like something that would be better handled by Dr. Fallen herself. Okay. I mean, it's right there, right? And hey, look, we have a breakthrough on pistols. go with the plus one damage to a weapon again. I will begin our research immediately. Now, do I build this in engineering? New orders, Commander. Probably proving grounds. Probably. I'm not seeing it here. Although I can make a proximity mine. It just costs resources. resources I don't have much of. Pickings are slim, but I'm hoping we find a few more recruits who can handle a wrench. I could use the help. I know. Rage suit. Sure! We'll get started right away, Commander. I'll send word when the project is complete. I didn't get to see what it actually does. It didn't say. Oh. That's why I skipped through. It was the same short description that we saw earlier. I suppose since that worked, we might as well keep it up, Commander. Sweet! Plus one mobility! I mean, thank you, Jessica Burns. Doctor. Stop. Word is, we've got a new trick or two Ooh, available, we have new Commander. Stuff. Maybe we should give them a try. So, combat intelligence. Uh, don't really need right now. An engineer could always use. Lower the cost of shadow chamber construction by 50%. That sounds yes. really useful right about now. Downside is it cost me a scientist to do. Tell eh. Soldier bond. Increases dodge plus nine. one hit point. Another mobility and also getting loot. Level up a soldier. Okay. Plus one mobility again. And modular shotguns. Allows for an additional upgrade slot. Interesting, but I think we have a very obvious choice here. This time, I think I'll have the... You know what? Let's just throw the same um, ranger at it again. Add the scientist. Uh, Mina can do this. 
yeah, I can afford a regular soldier. Gary, your skills are needed once more. Over Go. is our specialty. Let's just hope your people can keep up. Oh, shut up, Riker. I don't really need to. Blue screen rounds. There we go. All right. What are we grabbing now? Our options are resistance contacts. Yep. Avenger plotting new course. Our option is resistance contacts. Which we have spare right now, but that's okay. I'm glad to see our joint effort paid off like we hoped. Suspicious lack of aliens doing anything. There was yeah, this one. Gonna need, have to use a sergeant, unfortunately, but that's fine. We have plenty. Go with big time. And then for mobility, let's keep using stalker because I really want to see what happens if I keep increasing mobility. <laughs> oh, and I'm totally going to get XCOM. My followers will lead this action to Thanks, victory. Kiri. Hey, look, Rage Suit. Incredible protection, damage resistance, and mobility. Rapidly spike the adrenaline of the wearer, enabling them to rush enemies for a powerful melee attack. So we're wearing the flesh of our defeated enemy. I mean, sure? Hide. It's high dark. <laughs> Commander, we might have to do some cleaning, but we've still got room to grow here. We should consider building some new facilities. I would love to, except that you have no space in your ship. So I'm just looking at, okay, what does this actually look like? Looks like it's made out of meat. We're making progress against the aliens, yes. and it sounds like we're starting to get the civilians' attention in the colonies. It's important that the crew knows people out there right. need us and want us Central, to help turn this thing around. About this. They have to know there's a reason to We've only got one of these things, so be careful with it. Just because you look like a berserker doesn't mean you can go charging off into combat like they do. So it's plus six hit points compared to plus four before. Plus one mobility and plus one armor. That seems really nice. I'm just keeping it for the next mission. Whenever that happens. This will prove to have been an important breakthrough. Yeah. Yes, I'm aware. Okay. So we have data crash. Uh, data cache decryption, which I think that gives us intel. But I want assassin weapons. Because I've never done these, because this is the first time that I've played with this expansion. I agree. That is an important task, Commander. Yes, because they have a katana. There we go. All right. So. This one counteracts the trying to claim soldiers, or trying to capture soldiers, and our rewards an engineer. Operation Unceasing Love. <laughs> I mean, the operation name's the best part, obviously. Operation Enduring Moan. Even better. <laughs> This is the one that I probably want to do because that's the counteracting reinforcements. But we do have the chance that we're going to engage with the Warlock, though. Mm. But in theory, it's less difficult. What's the last one? Operation Potent Key! <laughs> 
yeah, it, it's going to be this one. Okay. Oh. Energy signal at the mission site suggests high levels of psionic enemies present. That one has the lost. And that one's just normal people. Anyway, shall we save an exit at this point? I think so. Okay. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this internet, and we're going to play this again, I swear. It won't be nine months. It'll probably be more like a day or two, I would think. Um, hope you've enjoyed this, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye, internet! See ya. Ah, darn it. It alt-tabs, so OBS didn't actually stop. So now I'm going to stop.